The South African mining industry has been the biggest driving force behind the growth and development of Africa's wealthiest economy for the last 150 years. Be it minerals, diamonds or precious metals, the manpower and infrastructure required to bring these materials to surface are huge, and the industry is in constant need of innovative solutions to improve efficiency and streamline the process. Heat and humidity are a constant issue and limiting factor in underground mines, where the virgin rock temperatures can exceed 60 degrees Celsius. The excavating activity adds to this natural heat, creating uncomfortable working conditions for the miners, with detrimental effects to their health, safety and performance. In the battle to raise social standards, improve the underground conditions and save energy, South African mines are giving special attention to the management of heat. KTI Plush are the global leaders in containerized ice plants and have researched and developed cost-effective mine cooling solutions with ice that are acclaimed as a real breakthrough in the industry. To put it simply, our systems lower the temperatures at the heart of the mine, provide megawatts of refrigeration, overcome the limitations of heat rejection underground, save water pumping energy, and enable thermal storage. This gold mine is located in the Free State and employs 3,800 people. It mines to a depth of 2,400 meters and operates three shifts with hundreds of men and women underground who depend on refrigeration. Without the proper air conditioning, these miners would only be able to execute their tasks for a limited period of time. An 8 megawatt, 1,200 tons per day KTI plant is installed next to the mine shaft, and it is here where the ice is manufactured. The ice travels along a conveyor belt to the top of the shaft, where it is introduced into the mine at 15 kilos per second. The ice freefalls almost two kilometers down a pipe into a two million liter dam at level 55. The underground dam water is cooled by the ice to an average of six degrees Celsius. From that cold sink, water is circulated to the tools and spot air chillers, which cool the remote work areas to 27 degrees Celsius and below. On the return line, mud is settled out at the bottom of the mine. The warm water goes back to the dam where it is rechilled with ice. Surplus water is then pumped back to the surface. The main benefit of using ice comes from its unique latent heat of fusion, which provides significantly more cooling than water. Chilled water picks up 4 degrees for every 1 km travelled, and by the time the water makes it underground, it is already lukewarm. By comparison, ice takes a few seconds to drop down the pipe and does not experience a change in temperature as it travels down from the surface, landing in the dam. Once it thaws underground, the meltwater is still much colder than any water that would have been introduced from the surface for the water-based system. In real terms, it means that this mine uses six times less water by using an ice-based system. This effectively creates a potential annual saving of over 3 megawatts in pumping power, which equates to $2 million per annum. The new KTI containerized ice plants introduce a complete paradigm shift. The PLIP 200 unit is a modern 1.2 megawatt plate ice plant prefabricated at KTI in Germany with a capacity of 200 tons per day using advanced refrigeration technology. Water flows on the stainless steel plates of the refrigerated ice maker where it is frozen. Once the optimal thickness is reached, the ice is harvested by a hot gas defrost process, running at high evaporating temperatures with a high coefficient of performance. Each unit of electrical energy consumed generates three times more cooling energy. Through standardization in design, KTI has considerably reduced the capital cost and the times of commissioning sizable ice plants. The plate ice plant can be installed in just two weeks. As is the case with this mine, 
large ice plants all over the world are made up of several smaller self-contained PLIP modules. As a result, they have become cheaper to build and operate. As the cost of pumping water is rising, ice cooling should be a serious consideration for any new mine deeper than 1,000 meters. The other innovation is the fact that KTI ice plants are expandable and movable. As a mine gets deeper over time, more PLIP can be added on as required. KTI Plush's turnkey solutions undoubtedly offer an incredibly strong value proposition. With innovative design and cost-effective ice plants, KTI is leading the way to new refrigeration solutions for underground mines.